On the evening of July 10th, 2006, a newlywed couple were driving through a 10-year-old section of an interstate highway tunnel beneath the city of Boston. 26 tons of concrete ceiling panels and debris collapsed and crushed their car, killing the woman and injuring her husband. The failure of a group of adhesive anchors had set off a chain reaction, causing multiple ceiling panels to fall onto the roadway. Safety inspections after the accident identified 242 potentially dangerous bolt fixtures supporting the ceiling tiles in the tunnel. The purpose of this program is to make sure that someone going out and inspecting anchor installations knows what to look for. They need to know from an inspector's point of view, they also need to know from an installer's point of view, because ensuring that this anchor is installed correctly is the main goal of this whole program. ACI's post-installed concrete anchor installation inspector program evolved from the adhesive anchor installation inspector program. Both programs were developed through the efforts of ACI committee members sitting on the C680 Adhesive Anchor Installer Program Committee. As active leaders in the Adhesive Anchor Installer Program in their local concrete communities, they identified a missing link in the quality chain. When the installer program became functional with the ACI, and I became an examiner and started giving classes to installers. It was an eye-opener for the installers, but I think it was an also an eye-opener for everybody else, realizing that, hey, what does an inspector look at and how do they know what to look at? So the need for an inspector program came to light and I think bringing it to the committee, everyone realized the same thing. The committee identified the reference codes, standards, and other industry documents they expected a qualified inspector would have knowledge of and would utilize in execution of their inspection responsibilities. They established the program requirements, the body of knowledge, and developed written exam criteria for the inspector. Well, it's helpful because although you would think that it's already in the knowledge base of the special inspectors, now it really isn't. This is very specialized and it adds to their broad spectrum of items that they are inspecting, but giving them the knowledge that they need to perform that inspection. The Adhesive Anchor Installer Program has been available to the industry since 2012 and has been a requirement of ACI 318 since 2011. In lieu of an inspector certification program, many inspectors have gone through the installer program just to gain additional knowledge and know what the installer is supposed to be doing. An installer actually has to demonstrate the skill. In the inspector program, that's not a requirement. However, the inst inspector is required to overview and um, watch during the installation process so that they can hopefully have a good appreciation for the difficulty associated with getting a proper installation. This inspector certification program does not require the candidate to demonstrate proficiency installing mechanical or adhesive anchors. The candidate is required to witness an actual hands-on practice session where adhesive anchor products are demonstrated. If nobody knows what to look for, how, to, how do we as a community, as an engineering community, an inspection community, and a construction community, make sure that life safety issues are taken care of by these anchors being installed correctly by not only an installer, but by an inspector making sure and overseeing the process that it's done correctly. ACI has over 40 sponsoring groups in North America currently offering both the adhesive anchor installer and the post-installed concrete anchor installation inspector programs. For availability of this program in your area, contact your local ACI sponsoring group or ACI certification department at 248-848-3790.